game, they were about 35 9 and they were points off turnovers. I mean, it's turnovers was a game. You know, too many of those turnovers led to easy baskets on the other end, got the crowd in the game. And, uh, that was our number one goal, the first thing we talked about uh, before the game, was uh, not allowing those pick six turnovers that turn into a huge play on the other end, and uh, uh, we weren't able to execute that part of the game plan. How much of that was you guys, and how much of it was them? Well, we know how they're going to play, so what they did wasn't a surprise. So either we turn it over or we don't. So I'd say that's pretty much on us. Obviously, they played hard, they competed. You know, they, they brought more energy than we did, um, but uh, you know, we were lazy with our passes, lazy with our cuts, and uh, obviously Oregon uh, took advantage of that. When Doug goes out with those two quick fouls, how much does that change just the way you want to try to attack? It's our leading scorer and leading rebounder. Right. So uh, obviously it, uh, you saw what happened when he wasn't in the game. And, he cannot get that first foul 94 feet from the basket. That's that's a foolish, foolish play on his part. Uh, but uh, you know, we didn't have guys step up uh, when he was in foul trouble the way we needed to. We needed to keep that game within uh, striking distance of halftime. Specific adjustments for the this last game? No, we know what they're going to do. They know what we're going to do. It's strap it up and you play. Maybe we're going to have to take care of the basketball. Uh, guard the dribble a little bit better, and if we do that, we'll have a chance to win. If we don't, it's going to be a long plane right home. Like they really doubled the post on that part of the game. They, they played more man to man uh, than they did uh, uh, in Monday's game, and we've, you know, we've seen a steady diet of, of zone uh, in the CBI. And it was San Jose was primarily zone, Creighton was, or uh, Oregon was zone pretty much the last game. And, Central Florida threw some zone at us as well. As did Davison on a few possessions. So we haven't played against man-to-man -man defense as much lately. And uh, you know, we certainly didn't execute when we had opportunities to do so. You did run some zone a little bit during the game. That seemed to be helpful at all, or did that? I think it's, I mean, you know, we're just trying to break their rhythm. Uh, they were in such a good rhythm against our man-to-man -man defense. And uh, we don't play zone a lot. And I thought when we did play, it was effective. Yep. Yeah,